Hello, I'm Christian Zarif, your 2016 KCRAR president. Earlier this month, I traveled with over 30 of our members to Washington, D.C. to attend the Realtors Legislative Meetings and Trade Expo. There, we were joined by over 8,000 members from across the country to meet with members of Congress about important issues affecting our industry today. Here to talk more about those issues and the important things coming up on the docket are Jeff Carson and Derek Ramsey. That's right, Christian. Last week, thousands of realtor members from across the country converged on the nation's capital to take our message of private property rights to the nation's leaders to garner their support. One of the issues we discussed was the National Flood Insurance Program. That program is slated to be extended in 2017. In addition to the extension, we'd like to make some changes to uh, bring the private market into the uh, insurance, the flood insurance business, uh, making sure that accessibility and affordability are available to those who have uh, federally backed mortgages. As you know, condominiums are often the most affordable pathway to home ownership for millions of Americans, but oftentimes financing is met with a lot of bureaucratic red tape. Our message to Congress last week was to remove the barriers to condominium financing and make it more accessible to get quality mortgages. We also discussed the mortgage interest deduction and how important that is to homeowners. Uh, NAR statistics show that 75% of homeowners claim the MID on their federal income taxes. Additionally, if that protection were to go away, uh, home values would drop 11% overnight. Another important component in our, in our tax reform plan is the preservation of a 1031 exchange. These like-kind exchanges are very important in commercial deals, uh, huge in the economic development world, and we want to make sure that they're protected as well. Another big topic in Washington were G fees. G fees are fees that are charged by Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac to lenders for bundling and selling of loans. There was a recent attempt by the Senate to use these fees to fund a transportation bill. Our message to Congress was to make sure that fees such as these that are generated by housing stay with housing-related programs. So, Jeff, you know the reality in Washington right now is that it's an election year, and typically it's very difficult to get things done in an election year. Our flood insurance bill passed the House unanimously with 427 members voting in favor. Our condo bill passed with 419 to nothing and yet no action has been taken in the Senate. The one thing that was evident last week in Washington was the strength of the Realtor Party. When thousands of Realtors converge on the nation's capital to take their message to the nation's leaders, it makes a huge impact. 2017 is going to be a big year for issues like tax reform, and we need to make sure that Realtors are at the table when these decisions are being made. And that's it for this year's 2016 Legislative Mid-Year Meeting Wrap-Up. We want to thank you all for your membership and your participation. Remember, the strength of the Realtor Party is in our numbers and with you.